Hello, here's a video of Geos booting on my 1541 Ultimate 2 Plus. And uh, let's turn the computer on here. And uh, it's go ahead and boot Geos. Oh, hang on. It's not seeing my USB. Let's try this again. There we go. Let's go down to Geos here. And first I load my REU. So I'll load this into memory. And then I got my freeze image. And I'll just run disk. And let's see how long this takes. And I'm all set. I got my all my apps in my REU here. Everything I use. And uh, let's go exit it. And I'm going to boot again using the normal method. And I'll go ahead and turn off the computer again and just start completely over. First I load the REU and then I'm going to into my normal boot disk here and uh, this is going to take a while so And for some reason, it didn't work. <laughs> Let's turn it off and try again. That was kind of weird. Sometimes my 1541 Ultimate loses connection with the thumb drive. I don't know what causes it. But... Okay, let's try this again. Uh, you know, I think there it goes. This is what it looks like when you boot uh, Geos with the uh, MP3 update, Mega Patch 3. Uh, Mega Patch 3 lets you use uh, four uh, megabytes on your REU, even though I can, I can have up to 16 on this, uh, Geos could only see up to four with Mega Patch 3. And uh, as you can see, it takes a long time just to do a normal boot. And uh, once it gets started, it no longer uses the Jiffy DOS because uh, Geos overrides it with its own fast loader, which is unfortunate.
See, it feels, back, feels like we're back in the 80s again, doesn't it? There it goes. Okay. And just for shits and grins, we'll go ahead and boot it again the fast way. Okay, let's try it back. Okay, again, load the RU first. And then go into the freeze. So this way it takes advantage of uh, Jiffy DOS for loading the whole freeze image. And there we go. Thank you for watching.